on my Facebook page, James Hancock posted a complaint about stupid speed limits. There's no evidence that they save lives. In fact, Montana, when they removed limits entirely, ended road rage and accidents. Now, in fact, that's exaggerated. They didn't end road rage and accidents. But it's true, they got rid of speed limits, and deaths did not go up compared to other states. Eventually, a court threw that out. But it's nuts where they say 55 miles per hour. Every, if you drive 55, what happens? People honk at you, they zip by you, it's more dangerous. It's but the, this, the regulators are trying to micromanage our lives to say, we've determined that 55 is optimal for you. Now, luckily, in many cases, we can ignore the law, don't right. go too fast, but they're not following this 55 mile per hour thing. In New York, a speed limit might be more appropriate than in Montana, where you've got wide open roads. Perhaps no speed limit's the right thing to in do. In New York, all of us break it. Every, 50, everybody's going 65. Yeah, but if there was 55. no law, you know, I'd be going 120 miles an hour all the time, and I'd have even less hair than I have now. There used to be a law on the books that prohibited states from going yes. above 55, and that law was repealed under Bill Clinton. Good for Bill. He did some good <laughs> things. <laughs>